and I'm the principal of this great school. And today, we are handing out the National Elementary Principals Citizenship Award. And so this award is given to students of schools whose principals belong to this national organization. And so we've been handing out this uh, award for the past three years to our outstanding citizens here at North Coventry. I actually kind of think that this day, I look forward to this day, you can imagine, because people think that principals only deal with bad kids. Um, it's kind of true, uh, but I do get to know all of the students. And I really look forward to this day, not just to celebrate our students, but really this day is a celebration of great parenting. You know, moms and dads, grandmas and grandpas, pat yourselves on the back. This doesn't just happen. Kids like this just don't pop out the womb and are great. They are great because of great parenting and grandmas and grandpas that love them and aunts and uncles that are active in their lives. So it's really, it's a big tribute um, to you as well. So the criteria for this award was that teachers, when they were not looking for students to nominate, the student had to demonstrate a positive attitude towards classmate, school, and community, an understanding and appreciation for helping others, the strength of character, and the courage to do what is right. They promote citizenship within the school or community through other activities, and they participate in school and or community service. So that was the primary criteria. As I talk about each of the students, you're going to hear several of the teachers comment about Wally's way. And so for you, those of you that don't know or don't follow us on Facebook, well, this is Wally. And Wally is our school's mascot. Everyone knows we are the O.J. Roberts Wildcats. Well, in North Coventry, this is Wally. And this is Wally's wearing one of our shirts that he wants everyone to wear on field day. And so at our school, we promote citizenship through Wally's Way. We talk about we respect ourselves, we respect others, we respect our school, and we respect our environment. And so we're teaching all of our students those lessons every day. And they are Wally Wildcat tickets, and all of your kids probably have heard lots because they're the good citizens. Um, but we want that for all of our students. And so that's how we promote that for all of our students here at North Coventry. So you'll hear teachers comment about Wally's Way and how students have demonstrated their citizenship through Wally's Way. Now, boys and girls, here's how it works. Some of you have received this award before. I've noticed that there's a pattern for some of you. Some of you, this is your first time. Here's how it's going to work. I'm going to call your name. You're going to walk up here, and I'm going to place a medal around your neck, because everybody gets a medal today, a citizenship medal. And I'm going to say wonderful things about you. Stand here and listen to those wonderful things that I'm going to say about you, and then you get to go to your seat. All right? We'll forgo shaking of hands. We'll save that for some other formality later in your life. We won't do that today. This requires more talent than I probably have. And I see shorter students than me must have been singing in the microphone. And a very strong band must have tightened it. All right. We're gonna, um, you have your program, and so we'll go in order as to the names that are on the program. So first we have Kaylee Glaze. Kaylee is in Ms. Bevin's morning kindergarten. Kaylee is a student who promotes citizenship with her school and community. She shows a positive attitude towards her classmates, and she is always willing to help others. Congratulations. Help others and do what is right. Nicholas strives to do his best in all things 
and help others along the way. Gabriel Cole. one day forget a routine. He answers with an okay and gets it done. He has never answered with a whine or a hint of disrespect. As I noted one day that the class was sitting especially quiet, I congratulated them. Thank you for sitting so quietly. This is amazing. Gay raised his hand and said, completely honestly, isn't this how we are supposed to be sitting? <laughs> yes, Gay. I have seen him interact outside of our classroom in assemblies and with other teachers, and it is always with the utmost respect. He has a genuine heart and a great attitude. I hope he carries it with him always. Caitlin has a sense of self and will make great choices, even if others around her do not. She has the respect of her classmates, who more often than not will model their behavior from her. One of the great rewards of being a teacher is watching a student grow from a shy, unsure student into a respectful, confident one. I got to do this this year with Caitlin. Jack is in Ms. Bevan's afternoon class. Jack possesses strength of character and the courage to do what is right. He is always going out of his way to help others do the right thing. He shows a positive attitude towards his classmates. attitude in all things she does. She tries her best in every activity and strives to help her classmates do their best as well. She promotes citizenship in our classroom daily. Always in a respectful way. 
We've enjoyed many conversations with Isa this year, mostly over SNAP, and I look forward to seeing the difference she will make in the world. Jack is also in Mrs. Reynolds' afternoon class. One look at Jack's face, and you will know why he is worthy of a citizenship award. Just by looking at him, you can tell that he follows directions, helps others, and always tries his best. Right, Mom? Not only does he always show respect to adults, he always shows respect to his classmates as well. He is patient with them, even when they are impatient. Jack does not participate in teasing in any way. He is willing to help out in any way necessary. He does all this all day with a smile on his face. Jack loves school, loves his friends, and loves to learn. And it shows. A good citizen needs to feel this excitement and passion. It will carry him far in life. others out and help keep our room neat and tidy. Ava always wears a smile and shows enthusiasm for learning. She has worked hard all year academically. She will be missed by Mrs. Beeler next year. follows the rules and looks to do the right thing. Whenever someone needs help, Reed can be counted on to lend a hand. He is kind and respectful to both his classmates and teachers. Any teacher would be lucky to have Reed in his or her classroom. I need more practice, I need buddy. Ethan is in Mrs. Bittler's class, and Mrs. Bittler said Ethan is a kind, respectful, and ambitious young boy. He is always eager to please, yet remains true to himself. He lives by the Boy Scout code and always has the courage to do what is right. He is a natural leader, and his love for learning makes him a pleasure to teach and an asset to his classmates. and is always the first volunteer to recite North Coventry's Wild Cat Way. She is loved by her peers and brings joy to her room, her compassion, love of life, and smiles. He always tries his hardest and has a positive attitude towards school. Hardworking and 
has a positive attitude towards others. guiding others with a smile. He is also a Cub Scout, where he enjoys working with a group in, our, in his community. He is, his humorous personality attracts friends in our room like a magnet. exemplifies the characteristics that are desirable in an American citizen by being very thoughtful of others, always willing to help someone in need. Whenever someone is feeling down, Angelina is quick to speak up with thoughtful words of encouragement. She is a young lady who is very inclusive, seeking not to shut others out, but rather to make them part of what is going on. As her teacher, I appreciate having her willingness to do the right thing, not the easiest thing. Talon is a reliable student who takes learning serious. 
He is, he is responsible, respectful, and a good citizen. He tries his best to achieve his goals and to set a good example for others. takes learning seriously and sets a good example for others. She makes positive choices about how to act as a good citizen and her efforts in the classroom have helped her have a fantastic year.